Yeah, I know that. That's fine. I'm, I'm, I'm fine. Don't listen to anything I said when I was drunk. How about that? You know what I mean? I, okay, so we were talking and this guy, he was telling me about there being horse meat in Burger King burgers. And that made me hungry for a Whopper. So I'm going to go get a Whopper. You think vegan nuggets are going to make anyone horny? I don't think so. Get a life. Yeah, people were telling, saying that you talked about your vagina smelling like barracuda and ricotta or something like that. No, I didn't. You guys are using this until you had your advantage making things up I didn't even say. You said it's All I'm like going to say is somebody wrote, they're not wrong. I said it smells like, everyone smells like fish. You will lose your channel again. Okay, bye hamburger eyes. I will lose a member, that's for sure. Bye. I'm hungry. I've been on my own. I've been on my own for long enough. It's Queen Starfish. Maybe you can show me how to love. Maybe. Oh, he's hot. Fucking big hands. I'm not doing OnlyFans. I don't think I want to be a porn star. I miss my ATM. I miss my MTV. I miss my ketchup. You know, they, they have hot dogs. They're really sure. Yeah, I surely have an all-day snack bar. But hey, they don't got no relish. They don't got no ketchup. And they don't got no mustard. I said, what do you want me to do with that? Dry as friggin' hell. I hate entitled people. Like myself, no. Where's everybody, uh... Hi! Bling! Bling! It doesn't have the weird... Can you please label your fupa pic next time? Wasn't sure what parts I was looking at, to be honest. <laughs> Are you fupa shaming? Uh. Excuse me, sorry. Sir, wake up! <laughs> so you know what? Sit on it and rotate. I'm having boundaries from now on. So, as you can see, my mental health is very fragile. And I'm tired of people being all up my ass. So, actually, I'm going to get St. Hubert's. I wish. I need a bun and gravy right now. I'm tired. Every single time I post a video, it's the same fucking idiots talking shit. The same ones have the nerve to come here with their busted faces yeah, yeah. talking shit about me. Like, go away then. You've been harassing my nutsack for three years. So... Comments off. I don't need your comments. And boundaries, which means I'm protecting my energy, as you can see, okay? Because I don't have very much positive energy right now. Thank you. It's a 2x, too. Yeah. I don't know how I'm 336, but a 2x. So the scale, I'm going to smash it. I don't give a fuck how much I weigh. And I don't care if you are offended by my fupa. By the way, oh yeah, let's get to Shloman El Shloman. I'm not going to say his name, but this person has the nerve to body shame me. Really? And you're like, you're calling yourself now what? You're just trying to rebrand. You're what? You're now a health and fitness channel? And you're going to like talk about fupa? You were just trying to pet my fupa the other day. You're going to actually like, why would I make up? Why would I make up making out with you? What would I gain from a nobody from Gatineau? Another one. What would I gain from claiming another nobody from Gatineau? Actually, you're the one who's desperately trying to become a reaction channel. You probably have some loser in your ear. You should talk about Chantal. Try it. Try it. He wouldn't ex You had two subscribers. When I met him, oh, you have a YouTube channel? Hmm. <laughs> Goes, goes, I go, oh, where's yours? Two subscribers. So you better shut the f*** up and thank me for those haters of mine you have following you now. Yeah, you better thank me. You're going to call me an ugly gorilla? What the f*** do you think you look like? Oh, you have a huge cranium and nothing in it. With baby hair. And you're going to make fun of me? Really? Let's not forget why I'm pissed at you, you freaking clout-chasing loser. And that's all I'm going to say about you. Um, let's see. I'm still farting in my sleep when I hear, bling, bling. Oh, concerned Roman blowing the my phone all day, trying to get some views to get my reaction when my channel was deleted. Nice person you are. So you know what? Sit on it and rotate. It's nice and pointy and new for you. Yeah, like I said, go get some Manuka honey that you're so obsessed with and cure your bitterness. You need it. He said my car smelled. We all know it fucking stinks. Whatever, it was dirty. So what? And do you honestly think you're exposing me for anything? Go clean your car. Go to the convoy, you COVID spreading loser. Clout chase. I'm sick of clout chasing losers coming after me. All over. You help more refugees than UNICEF. <laughs> He has zero tea. Actually, it's clean right now. I did clean out my car. What? Ooh, what are you going to say now? Want a car tour? It's actually really clean. I did clean it out. What are you going to say now? I'm bald. Look, Roman. So are you. Block raging coming. 
Roman is more bald than me, and he has the nerve to call me bald. I literally made myself bald. Next, I have a fupa. Oh, a fitness channel? You're going to be a fitness channel and body shame women? Next, don't even come for me, Roman, because you won't win. You won't win. And you call yourself a chef? Well, you're going to come make tagine. So what do you do? You go on your channel, you make boiled corn and cauliflower with Heinz ketchup and vegan nuggets? You think vegan nuggets are going to make anyone horny? I don't think so. Get a life. I'm tired of it. I'm laying in bed all angry. I'm just angry, probably because I'm freaking off everything. Let's smoke. He's mad because I said he had bad breath. Well, don't freaking, you freaking like harass me when my channel is like deleted. I find, I didn't even find out yet. Here you are on live, Ain't hungrily waiting with my haters on your fucking one in Gatno. Go away. And then you, then you post like a week up, you post encouraging foodie beauty to take BBJ to the vet. Um, excuse me, you did? I had that post up a week, week before you even said that, that I was taking BBJ to the vet. Like, really? Are you serious? Yeah, the black garlic gave him but No, because he had strep throat and he still made out with me. How considerate. You're such a health person, but hey, you've had strep throat. What else have you had recently? COVID. You're getting all these illnesses that, hmm, let's see. I mean, I'm so unhealthy. I never have them. Fucking garlic's working wonders, isn't it? No, I don't have strep throat in a while. <laughs> yeah, she has hair in like 50,000 fucking moles. She's a freaking oh my god, don't even go. Don't even, I'm not even gonna address these morons. I'd rather have no hair than be her. I'd rather be bald. I actually don't mind having no hair. So try again, send more money. Honestly, who would you rather be? Would you want to be her? Nobody would want to be her. Isn't shabby insane? Yeah, yeah, and has the nerve, really. I don't even, I'm not even giving these amoebas any more of my, that's the, that's the point of this. All of these people who are beneath me are not going to get any more of my energy. These energy vampires are not going to. So block, staying blocked. Okay, and I'm not, I'm not apologizing for anything anymore, really, fuck it, whatever, I'm not apologizing, I, you know what I mean, like, for things that, just every single thing I do gets attacked, and like, oh, what about this, address this, at least Shabby has hair, have you seen it? it looks like a fucking stork's nest, I'm sure her fucking par good parenting is lost in her hair somewhere, she should probably shave her head, ugh, I've seen the videos, you're disgusting, shut up and go away, and don't judge people, oh, Dawn's gonna be our first block of the day, fuck, goodbye. And I'm not unblocking people. So if you fuck up, like I said, seriously, I'm not. I've, I've talked to friends about it. I've made this decision. I've I really waited to now to make that decision. Like, you're gone. You're going to have to make another account. And if you're an asshole, I will block you. And then you'll have to pay again. And you will do it because you're obsessed. I don't understand. Like, I know I can be abrasive and like rage and everything. But I don't understand why people don't understand that sometimes it's a little too fucking much. Like, does nobody get that or what? No one deserves abuse and hate. I'm tired of it. <laughs> Look at my messy couch. I have a Rasta hat and leftover Greek food. And what's his face is gonna out me for my messy car? Like, here you go. Here's more to out me on. Look, old tzatziki, old tzatziki, old olives, cat treats, Kleenex, Rasta hats. What else do you want? Uh, pita. There you go. I got you some nice. Here, I'm gonna help your channel some more. How about that? How about I give you some more clout? Make fun of my table. Here you go. I don't remember your house being too clean. Your room looked, smelled like a fucking bachelor's balls. But here you go. Anyways, moving on. I'm just, I'm just had it with people, you know? I'm just, ha I've just had it. So, there you go. No, I didn't go see a personal trainer today. <clears throat> I don't know. I, I'm supposed to go see that, that uh, Ricardo guy. I haven't decided because it will depend on if I want to, um, hold on, if I really want to do OnlyFans. Okay, don't you just love people who pretend like they're all for God and Jesus and everything else and then the most hateful pieces of shit on the planet? I like that too. He said he had a girlfriend. Okay, well, he's a liar. How about that? <laughs> he's a fucking liar. <laughs> like, Roman said, he, why would I lie? Like, what would I get out of lying about making out with this person you can always make more money and it's not just about money so you know that's why i'm thinking like is it something i want to do hi happy chino i'm not sure because i have to think really carefully about it so i might i don't know i'm also just sick of people like <sighs> here's the thing i know i said this before like i would say i'm sick of people if i'm not if i change my mind about going live or if i don't go live for a few hours or if i change my live pattern People just like automatically go sh ape shit and abuse me verbally over and over and over because they think I'm back with an adder. Number one, number one, number one, that's not always the case. Like that just drives me nuts and it makes me defensive because it's like, even if I was, even if I did, it doesn't give me 
right, to verbally abuse me no matter what. Because no matter, like, no matter what, I'm not hurting anybody by doing what I want to do in my life or what I do or by making mistakes in my life or by making bad decisions. It's my life to fuck up. This is not, this is a, this is my real life. Okay, Elon, goodbye. This is my real life. Go roll your eyes somewhere else. See what I mean? I get that reception just because, like, I'm literally at home and people are, like, freaking out. I don't. People are so emotional about my life, exactly. You're so bothered, then go away. It's not your business. It's not anyone's business what I do. You can disapprove of it and then you can leave and unsubscribe. Whatever. If you if you just like people the fact that I can't even have a private life for a few hours without people going ape shit over it is annoying. It's so especially when I'm trying to get over shit, especially when I'm trying to just live my life. I just I don't get it. How does it even fucking affect you? And you know what the worst thing is those same people who bitch are eagerly I also see comments like, I can't wait for this shit show when she's back at the trap. You need to get your head checked. You're so obsessed with a rela my relationship with people that you are at an obsessive level. And it's like weird. You need to get help. You need to get help, not me. And that's what I'm realizing. So these boundaries are staying. Okay, I'm a human. My feelings are valid. I'm going through shit. It's not easy to leave a fucking relationship like that. So screw you. If you don't understand that, you can leave. Because your ignorance and your abuse is not wanted here anymore. So good luck. Goodbye. If you think I'm a bad person for whatever, okay. Oh, well then. I can tell you, every single person is good and bad. Every single person is a piece of shit. And if you're in comments saying things like, you're a vile piece of shit, then you are too for saying that. So eat shit, okay? Bye. Okay, so they, they don't like seeing me hurt get hurt over and over, Sports Bob. So their answer to that is to verbally abuse me and shame me instead of, I don't know, being supportive and trying to understand or at least not saying anything or at least being at least fucking or I don't know. You don't, like, I just, I don't get it. I don't get why people like this exist. I don't get it. And if I'm too tired to get groceries and I want to order out, I will. Here she is ordering out again. Like they analyze it like it's like a psychology course 101. Monty has these group of loser women who are fucking obviously jealous of my existence. Like, what is your problem? Like you, 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 oh, I'm not jealous of her. Yeah, well, you're up on every panel talking shit about me. Does that not wreak bitterness to you? Am I the one on someone's panel talking shit about people? Have I ever done that? Have I ever gone, I come on here and rage for minutes at a time when I'm really hammered, but at the end of the day, I don't bully people on my fucking platform every day calling it reactions. Let's call it what it really is, Monty. Okay, yeah. I know I, I'm, I, I wanna make changes, yes, but Jesus. People like hold me to every single word like as if I'm supposed to be perfect. Like, okay, I say I'm gonna do something, so I'm just gonna do it automatically. No, it doesn't work that way. And I bet you every one of you are bums like me too. Give me a break. I don't care. It's like the thing is, it's like people are too involved. Like, I just I can't have that on my ch around. Like, I can't bees with negative people right now because, as you can see, like I need to just try to be as positive. I wanted to do like scenario videos, like actual like high production scenario kind of videos, but I'm not sure if I want to do like nude ones. I want to find a way to make use of my OnlyFans. I feel like I need to have an OnlyFans. I feel like I need to have one. So if I can come up with some kind of use for it, that would be fun and like me like my personality you know what i mean i just got to think of something i don't know but i'll see do people expect me to be nice i'm really curious do people expect okay listen my new rule i know i'll miss welcome to rainbow music if you're not if you're nice if you're an asshole to me then i'm then i'm gonna be an asshole back to you and uh, if if you're even worth it if you're not worth the time or energy like the person i just talked about but i had to address i had to say something because i'm raging right now then i'm just gonna ignore you like you're irrelevant or I will retell you back, it's too bad for you. But I mean, I don't come for people, like I'm a nice person, I never come for people. <clears throat> you know what I mean? Can you check your Instagram DM please, please, it's very important. Like right the second, important, like what is it, life or death? Or what is it? It better be if I check. Can you I'm hungry. But Chantel, don't you like a-holes and bad boys? No, I don't. I don't. All of my past boyfriends are not. And my future boyfriends also will not. And I don't understand why why this guy's coming for me now because he's obviously bitter that he thought he would have a platform because of me and doing cooking at my house. I'm not eating boiled corn for you. I am not going to do it. So there's a person on Instagram, Fat Miss T or something. I like post a picture of her like being like, good for you. I'm happy for you that you're you're okay with your body. So this fat positive person is getting harassed, which if you're an influencer, you should be fucking used to that. You just block people. Yeah. And is like, please take my picture down. I'm being harassed. Well, fuck you then. I'm, I'm never, ever, ever, like, this is what I mean. These people, fucking people, like, whatever. Okay, I won't fucking, I'm never posting anyone else who's 
I don't know. It's, it's fucking ridiculous. Really? Like, you're going to be worried about what a few haters think? You really don't have thick skin. You really don't care about it. You love yourself as much as you say. That's sad. Anyway, getting harassed. By who? A few haters? Why are you getting harassed? People are harassing you, saying you fat bitch. Like, like they're fat shaming you? But you're a body positive influencer. And you're worried about a few haters? That's so stupid. Oh, he's going to listen to what I said when I'm really hammered? I didn't come for his culture. What did I say against Moroccan people? What did I say? I need to know. Why can't you take it down? I did, Willow. I just think it's stupid. I think it's just stupid. Anyway. What's the little Jamaican thing in the back of the couch? Somebody sent me a rasta hat. I don't read the comments normally. Like, I just happened to check today. And I'm like, oh, guarantee it. I haven't been live. Let's see what people are saying. Sure enough. Here's the pattern. She went to Burger King. She's in fucking the trap. Like, nobody lives at the trap anymore. Don't you even see, like... Oh, annoying. You're so annoying. Go away. What is it to you if I'm in Montreal or not? I'm literally here in my fucking PJs. I'm in Montreal? When? When was I in Montreal? Oh, I hate people. I know I'm not drunk. I'm just angry. I'm annoyed. <clears throat> I am going to clean my house. I have a lot to do. I will do it when I can. I understand the irritation. Even just reading the comments about everyone's damn doctor or therapist. I mean, I understand. I expect people to be involved in my life. Just like you guys are frustrated. Like, I, like, you expect me to understand your frustrations with me? Well, then fucking understand mine with you. You know what I mean? It's two-way street here. It's a two-way street. If I've had enough, like, abuse for a day and I just really at my rope's end, like, wit's end, I'm just doing what I have to do to protect myself. Okay? It's my channel, exactly. I can vent if I want to. I know, he wants me to talk about him. He wants traffic at his channel. How is it going to feel to be a loser in my shadow just like a lot of other people on YouTube? All you ever said was his breath was bad. In my opinion, you're helping him out. Fix your breath, Roman. <laughs> if mine was bad, I'd want to know. And he had strep throat. What do you expect? I think it's way too easy for people to try and ruin your reputation over some dumb shit you say. And I'm sorry, but you're going to cancel me for saying an R word when I'm fucking hammered? The R word. Really? Who am I fucking hurting? <laughs> Seriously? Then cancel me. That's so stupid. That's so stupid. I hate people getting cancelled or banned permanently for being human and, and fucking making mistakes and saying something. Like, you're gonna ban somebody for saying a word? That's so fucking stupid. That's so stupid. No. Sorry. Anyway. Look up the term parasocial. Yeah, I heard all about that lovely term. I haven't looked it up yet, but... Anyways... I'm so crabby. I need to like go to bed and take some antidepressants or something, so. No, I'm not gonna hang out with Agatha. I don't even know where she lives. <laughs> Actually, I don't think I added her back on Facebook. I have to. Oh, my lip is all burnt or something. <sighs> Grocery haul? <laughs> Life by Gen style? What does that mean? Extrovert. In a lot of ways, I'm actually really private and quiet. Like, I know you guys, like, you guys really don't know me. <laughs> oh my god. You really don't. Actually, when I think about it, I'm actually, like, a little different, I guess, in my real life. A Roman posted a picture of a balding gorilla and said Chantal's fupa smelled like dirty diapers. How does, he never even came near my fupa. Never in a million years will he ever have the opportunity. You are going to wish you have, you, you wish you could smell my fishy You wish you could come near the fish of the fupa. You wish you could taste the cuisine of the fish of the fupa. You wish you could have caviar on the fish of the fupa. You wish. Oh, I'm making a song for you. It's a diss track called You Wish. You wish with your boiled corn dish. You wish with your boiled corn dish for some fish. But all you had was vegan nuggets. You <laughs> a bald newborn bird. We're all going to hell today. I'm going to hell. I've already come to the friggin' realization. I'm going to hell. I mean, I told God to F off when I was in Cuba. And furthermore, every day I've been raging and being super hateful. Oh, I need a lawyer, Susie, for so many reasons. So many reasons, you don't even know. I have to sue a whole bunch of people. <laughs> no, I want to get a copyright... I want to um, talk to a copyright lawyer. And also, just because I'm going to be... Like, especially when I start pumping out... But this is not to go after reaction channels who are using my contacts or informally or whatever. It's not about that. It's just I also need a lawyer for, like, other stuff, you know? I'm a friggin'... I'm a friggin Businesswoman. A SoundCloud rapper. Starfish on Spotify? <clears throat> Sorry. 
second verse, same as the first. <laughs> Lawsuit bees. Yeah, let's go and judge Judy. No, I'm not getting sick. I have a COVID test thing that I can take though, but no, my nose is not stuffy. But that made me sniff when he said that. Instead of a star is born, no car was. Yeah. <laughs> oh my god, Lacey! That was the funniest thing ever. Instead of a star is born, no car, just corn. Oh, he's such a bum. That's what annoys me. He's a bum and he's making fun of me. I hate when bums make fun of me. I hate it. We need be because it's the nerve that bugs me. The nerve! Hi, Cosmic. She's firm, but oh man, I love her because I love, I'm like, judge, whenever I'm watching the show and someone's up there, like the plaintiff's like, yeah, ma'am. I'm like, ooh, I can't wait for Judge Judy to nail him. And she does every time. <laughs> Sir, wake up. <laughs> Holy fucking shit, this woman, I hate the airplane because a woman, they, okay. For some reason they were all lining up. It, there was constantly somebody in my foot space waiting for the bathroom. What's the point of getting the extra leg room if it's just going to be used for a holding space for the bathroom? I felt like saying, like, listen, I even tell, told the waitress, I'm like, did you guys not announce for people not to crowd, not to line up in the in the aisle way to use the bathroom? There's a sign up in the ceiling that says occupied or not occupied. So listen to the stewardess and get your ass back to your chair. Okay. <laughs> I know. Go. He has the nerve to talk about me. That's the, that's what bugged me. You have to pay 50 bucks extra for an elite seat. I'm never, I'm never flying with Sunwing ever again. It's not going to happen. If I cannot fly somewhere comfortably, then I won't do it. I'm not going to give you my money for fucking basically fat shaming me. Like, it's it's the whole experience, if you're fat on a plane, is a whole fat shaming experience. First of all, you you get you you have to walk to the plane. People are already staring at you. I, I don't care, but I'm just saying for anyone else fat, too. It's just, it's ridiculous. It's just the principle. So you get on the plane, then you have people waiting behind you, and you're holding everyone up to ask for a seatbelt extender. So the, the stewardess, they look at you like, oh, yeah, sure. Like, they're acting all like, you want to be discreet about it? No, I have no shame in saying I need a bigger seatbelt. Fluffy Custard, welcome to Very Important Bees. Here's a very ready set bees. I have no shame in that, actually. <laughs> Why? You know? So, I get that. Then, um, I mean, it's just entirely, like, the seat's too small. It's uncomfortable. I can't shit for four hours. Uh, people are staring at you. It's just ridiculous. Flying fat is ridiculous. Absolutely. If I, in my lifetime, can do anything important in life, I want fat people fucking seats on an airplane. And I'm not going to stop until it happens, actually. So. Us baddies need our own airplane with a buffet. <laughs> right! <laughs> no, the food is good. They have a lot of food. I had no problem. I had a big pizza. Whatever. But a little bit more fucking room would be nice. They're literally this big. The seats are literally, literally this big. <laughs> literally. And the bathroom, don't even get me started. <laughs> it's all about people at home. Um, goodbye, L. You're not being unblocked ever again. You're annoying. I am newish and don't know. I, uh, go be self-righteous somewhere else. Fuck. Christ. Grow up. I'm newish and don't know the story of Jafar Ring. <laughs> I don't think you're new. Oh, well, if you don't, if you are new. Yeah, somebody else explain. <laughs> I don't feel like it. Um, I think road trips would be better, but yet again, you can't shit for three hours. <laughs> well, <clears throat> do you know there was a plane that was about the size of a cruise ship once? No, really? Oh, I didn't know that. I like bugs. That would be cool. You should trade in Kia for a minivan. Um, if you're taller, you have no leg room at all. Yeah. What about tall people? So you have to be like a certain average size. That's the problem. There's no average. Like it's, it's 2022. The fact that you're like putting all these people in boxes, like people are different sizes. People are different shapes. People are like, I just, I don't get it. It's always like, I don't get it. But of course people are going to go after watch. People are going to go after that. Chantel's opinion on fat. Well, it's your responsibility not to be fat. Shut the fuck up with that shit. And you know what? I, I just, I'm not, I, I, people are going to complain about, anytime I have an opinion on something, people complain about it. I'm not allowed to have thoughts or, or opinions or I'm not allowed to feel anything about flying fat. You know, I'm not allowed to, I should just always, always feel like shit about myself according to these people. So those are the people that are going to be bye-bye forever. And Al, I'm sorry, Tessa is like that. Always negative. If you don't like it, goodbye. I, I should block you just for liking Al, actually. Because I don't want those like-minded people here. So, yeah, I do watch my streams back sometimes. Um, God, these self-righteous people who have such a problem with me, what I said in my rant, are the same people who, fat -shamed probably, who probably fat-shamed me and Amber Lynn. Michael B. Petty.
Irv on Twitter giving me shit for what I say. Do you remember fat shaming Amber Lynn for bullying Amber Lynn a lot? A lot? And you still don't give a shit what you, about that? Mm hmm Shut up and have several seats, okay? And don't break the chair. Bye. Why is twice Twitter full of so many twat wannabes? Whiny twat wannabes, anyway. Every time I go on Twitter. What's your problem? Freaking whiny wannabes. Twats on Twitter. Twats on Twitter. Hashtag twats on Twitter. I'm going to start highlighting one of their comments every fucking day. Twats on Twitter. <laughs> I love your tweets. You bake them so easily. God. I, and I, I know, too. I'm like, watch, I'm going to write this. And then, like, I go for a shit. Come back. 2.5 minutes later. 78 comments. Go figure. Predictable. Predictable. That's it. Twitter's the cesspool, yeah. Okay, I'm going to bed. Oh, really? Your friend's going to Turkey for plastic surgery? Oh, gastric bypass surgery. Good luck to your friend, Karen. Good night, Leslie. Good night, everybody. Nori, Andrea, good night, everybody. Thanks for listening to me rage. I'm going to go to sleep. So, I will see you tomorrow. Bye. All right. I want to live in freedom. I want to dance with my demons. I want to drink for no reason. And celebrate every season. Yeah. Don't forget to subscribe. And if you like what you see, please buy my merch. Link in the description below.